Yo, what's up, everybody? Another Realm Hack Wednesday. Today, tried to search for one a little different. Get a new vibe going on here. We got some Zelda music because we've got a Zelda hack. It's called The Legend of Zelda Curse from the Outskirts. Uh, huh. Link Stink. I don't know what that means. Um, maybe that's the Luigi character? I'll have to check that out. But yeah, we're playing a Zelda SMB1 hack today. Okay, immediately we have to... One sec. I have to find the quickest way to die so we can see what Link Stink is. Oh. So this is Stink. Okay, let's actually play now. Okay. Goomba... Uh, well, gels for Goombas, or Zoles, I guess. That was the mushroom, it seems. It was like a potion. I guess because a blue potion refills your health once, so it basically like doubled my health. Ooh, I like that. The jumping sprite, classic. Blue spring is normal spring. <laughs> oh, oh, this is a Koopa, okay. Wait, what is it actually? Wake back up, I couldn't tell what, oh. It's an Octorok, I guess? Uh, I haven't played Zelda 2 that much, but I'm assuming it has Octoroks that look like that. Something really funny is I tried to, oh. I tried to go down the pipe and get some rupees. No, um, I tried to push B to swing my sword at the enemy, and I'm like, what am I doing, dude? Okay. We're getting some Triforce pieces, we're killing some Zoles. Oh, this is the end. I probably skipped a whole bunch. We gotta bring down Ganon's flag. Okay, no music during the cutscene. Interesting. Alright, Fire Flower? Or Fairy? Fairy power-up? Whoa! And they actually go horizontal. I have sword beams. Thank you, Great Fairy, for blessing me with <laughs> sword beams. That's awesome. Dude, get wrecked. So good. That's gonna be fun to play with. Okay. Yeah, that is a wall. I could test if it's a wall. That's so good. So are there invisible blocks, or...? Uh... I'm supposed to come up and over? Pretty early on the soft blocks here. Not a fan. <laughs> oh, that's a vine! Wait. Never mind. Wait, what? <laughs> okay, that was all just very jank. Whoa, that guy did not spawn last time. It's a moblin, I guess? <laughs> that's kind of fun. Dude, I want my sword beam back. I like that it's red and blue Koopas. Red and blue Octoroks, because that's how Zelda games are. But you do red and blue enemies. And the blue ones are stronger, so I guess the red ones are blue. Yo, you look real weird. Is that a Buzzy Beetle? This is a Sculptula, I guess. We have this pipe. This looks like Tails Paran or whatever it's called in Ocarina of Time. I don't know what it's called. Whatever that enemy is in Zelda 2. No, dude. I hate when they have these blocks I can't hit. I have to know what's inside. Wait, we have another enemy. Oh, it's a spiny, of course. I was like, what enemy is left? Me dumb. What were you doing? <laughs> okay. Potaboos are pretty normal. Whoa! There are fireballs in Zelda 1 dungeons. Again, I haven't played Zelda 2 that much. No warp zone, because the screen stopped scrolling. Bring down the Ganon flag! Interesting bullet bills. Just like... Oh, they're bubbles, right? Oh, dude, I'm never ready for that to be a vine. That's so weird. All right, we're back here. Uh, I guess we're jumping to this vine. <laughs> no, oh gosh. Hard, 
to get up here. <laughs> I really like this power up. <laughs> oh, the sound. That's so weird. Invisible block up here, definitely. If there's not, that's really lame. That's really lame. Okay. Pretty... Even though it's a totally different theme, it still had, like, the same theme for 1-3. So that's kind of interesting. What the... <laughs> what? Is... Why is it making that sound? Wow. Okay. The fire bar looks really cool. Oh, it looks that way because it's, like, my... It's my... Beam sword shots. Whoa! I didn't realize what it was. It's Bowser fire. Okay, okay, there's a million blocks. It's kind of trolly. <laughs> I don't know how it, I didn't get hit. Yo, Ganon. Whoa, he has more health. That's sick. How much does he have? He, okay, he had like 10 or something. I'm not sure. That was cool. That's awesome to give him more health. Normal Bowser doesn't have enough, and like, now I have beam swords with- or beams. Wait, I didn't read it. What did it say? The Triforce is somewhere else? In a different castle? What did it say? Triforce is in another palace? Right on. I think it would have been cool if they put... Well, so I don't know how Zelda 2 goes. In Zelda 1, you collect eight pieces of the Triforce. So, assuming this is eight worlds, I think it would have been cool if you, like, collected one Triforce each time. Like, the X at the end of the stages could be one, maybe? They are giving plenty of power-ups, which is nice. I feel like the difficulty is nice on this hack. It's like, sometimes... Oh, okay. Sometimes there's a decently hard enemy, but... They're giving me plenty of power-ups, and the power-up is really good. Now I can... I don't have to be, like, terrified that if I lose it, I'll never have power-up again. Hmm. Okay, we're swimming. Link looks a little awkward while swimming. This is a Zora. <laughs> we have some... Uh... I don't know what this enemy is, actually. I don't think I've seen any Zelda enemy like this. The jumping ones are blue, which is interesting because maybe that's just a color palette thing, but none of the ones on the last stage were blue. That's a cool distinction. Gosh. Wow, I thought I was gonna stomp it. They do appear in Majora's Mask. They're in the tanks in Garuda, or the Pirate Fortress. Right? I see. Wow, a Lakitu in a castle. Very interesting. Okay, this screen is straight out of 2-4. <laughs> Wait, oh, oh, oh! Small fire, small fire! Wow. Seems like he hit me really early. Maybe I just shouldn't have trouble with the sprites. Triforce in another palace. Who is this fella? Not sure. Yeah, that's a good point. This hack probably won't. Well, we'll see. Hopefully by World 8 it, it's not saying... <laughs> Please spam save states if you would like to continue. Almost every pipe lets me go in it. Also, all the pipes are, like, completely vanilla. Power up. Yep. I feel like I'd rather not try the pipes because they're pretty vanilla and then I'm just missing the actual custom levels. <laughs> we got the Triforce again. Uh, 
Sure, we'll go up the line. Sounds like climbing, it's just like... Yo, it is time. We're gonna do this anytime we can in a hack from now on, because game over is really lame. Okay. I have this star, I wanna run through enemies, but now there's a hundred blocks in. Oh. Okay, that's kinda weird. <laughs> I don't think I can break these. It's funny, these look like brick blocks. These right here. But I can't hit those. But I can break this. <laughs> they do like to put a lot of hammer bros in hard to kill places, but it's not nearly as bad as some of the others. This is, I will not complain about this at all compared to some things I have played <laughs> recently. Can we get points? We got points! <laughs> People that are on track team or swim team or whatever, you would never ask the same question to, right? But it's just the same thing. <laughs> I don't have mushroom, man. I got- I'm gonna get small fire, okay? I have to. I think that is straight up a vine block. Okay, this is a bullet launcher, but... Okay, it does shoot. <laughs> it's a bullet. I have to know what's in here. It's gonna be rough with these spinies. Nice, we got a coin. We'll never know what's in the other one. Okay, see so a coins. <laughs> Must get up. What? I bet the pipes earlier would have come out that pipe. <clears throat> Alright, pretty classic 4 1 level. You guys think there's a warp zone? Wait, you can't do this to me. Dang. I'm gonna jump in there. I'll just changing sprites. Wow. Why would you do this? <laughs> How disappointing. Alright. Stupid block. Wait, there's... Oh, there's a ton! Okay. I like it better, knowing that it's to make this vine work, but I don't know. I think it could have been executed better. Wait, this is going to be a warp zone. I asked that earlier. I was like, do you guys think there's a warp zone? Yeah, literally vanilla. Wait, oh, can I save this still? I have a way out. So I won't have to wait on the timer. Okay, we go in without loading it. It takes me back to the beginning without the vine there. I go in the hole. Let's go. <laughs> Saved. Now we can play all the levels. <laughs> this is impossible. You have to like fast excel one frame crouch jump. Now I spawn down here. See, I knew it would have been possible, like, as small, just coming in like this, but I broke some blocks, so it, like, didn't work anymore. <laughs> uh, what? Like, what? How are you meant to do that? You literally spawn down here. They, like, soft lock you unless you can do some kind of wall jump or clip. Like, what? How? That's so bad. Oh, there's just two one-ups, okay. Once you're over there, I do not think... I think this is the only solution. Like, that's insane. 
<laughs> okay, water level coming from the castle. I actually really like it. I can't hit this. What, did you mean for this to be a water level? Why? We, whoa. Yeah. <laughs> water physics spring. Dude, imagine the A press saves if we could do that. <laughs> oh, this is scales? But full flag pug glitch though? Regular flag pug glitch though? <laughs> Water castle? Okay, I like that even more. But it's just 4 4. I don't like that anymore. 4-4, but I have to take a different path? No! Oh, this is actually so bad. It's 4-4, but I have to walk so that I'm in the right place for the checkpoint, the maze trigger. I can't swim over it. That's actually so bad. Yeah, this ROM is like 18 years old. But my criticisms, I feel like, are... They already are showing what they can do, and then they, like only did 80% of what they should have with the tools that they were doing. Okay. What is down here? No! You can't, you can't take me. Oh, I can go over the pole. Yep, nothing there. <laughs> oh. The <laughs> link stayed up there. <laughs> Spring in ground? Wee. I almost expected, yeah. That's weird that they took the mushroom out, but like this screen is basically the start of 5-2. You can tell they took normal 5-2 and just changed it because you have the stairs with the bullet launcher. They added in all these bricks, but they left the spring kind of in the same spot. It used to be a little more left and not in the ground. And then normally there's a mushroom right here. Then there's stairs with the hammer bro. <laughs> they, they, like, they just like grab some blocks and put them up here and they're like, no one will notice now. Yeah, that's 100%. Wow, that was crazy disjointed. Now we're in a tunnel. What the heck? Okay, they got out of the way. That actually helps a ton. That was gonna be so impossible without that. Actually, vanilla buzzy beetles. <laughs> Even these are vanilla, they just move them up. <laughs> I hope the, there's some more good levels and they don't just get more and more and more vanilla, because <laughs> that's what it seems like. Okay, yeah. So... This is where the normal game repeats. And they did as well. But now we're on hard mode. So in 5-4, we're gonna replay what was 2-4 and it's gonna have more fire bars. That fire is above the screen. Why? <laughs> Whoa, platforms? Whoa! <laughs> Jump! <laughs> that is so Awesome. <laughs> now it's 6-2. Literally vanilla. This is getting a bit disappointing. Because it's more and more vanilla the more time goes on. 6-3. Man. It's like they were trying 90% and then 80 and then 50 and then 10. Dang it, man. Oh, but maybe we can do the bullet bill glitch, but not the one you're thinking of. I don't know if it has to be a certain height. Oh, I guess not. That's not where I expected it to work. <laughs> Let's go. I actually learned why this works recently. I never really knew, but I did know that, see, it starts drawing a line and I'm like, it thinks the bullet bill is like a, 
one of the scale platforms. Okay, there was a lift just off screen to the left, and normally the lift objects are two objects, right? The screen scrolls like this, right? So now there's only one object, and like, so it's over here off screen now, but over here, it thinks that the bullet bill is like the new right side of the this lift combo. So it's like the bullet bill is acting like this one. Okay, I already know. Wait, I don't already know! Oh, I don't wanna lose, well, actually it's fine if I lose it. I just want to do small fire, dude. Whatever else happens, happens. Yes! Now we can get small sword beam link. <laughs> okay, so now we, we shrink. Just gotta get past one more set of bros. Yeah, but it's all, it's all vanilla. <laughs> Okay. Gimme the very small sword beams. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> no! <laughs> Dude, that was so dumb. I gotta get them back, but it's probably a water level. Ugh. We had Link, we earlier we had Stink, now we have Shrink. All right, we set it up again. We just need to not get hit until we get fire in 8-3. <laughs> it's actually different. Hog. Oh. Maybe there's even a power-up. That'd be cool. Whoa. Okay, <laughs> weird. Oh, I can't hit this, actually. <clears throat> uh, okay, there's fire in the sky. Lava bridge. There's a coin block in the ground. Oh man, that was dang it. Well, small fire was very short-lived in this hack. There was a power-up right there. <laughs> God, that's so lame, man. Dang it. Okay, I'm actually fine with this level. Okay, vanilla coins, actually. <laughs> vanilla pipe, vanilla pipe, vanilla stairs. Yeah, whatever, it was fine. Stairs at the start? <laughs> they made it easier by making you not able to fall down. Although they did add this plant. Spooky. Oh. They kept the one up. How nice. Bro, I promise you this block right here has a power-up in it. They made it so I can't reach it. <laughs> Come on, man. Do you have an A-press? <gasps> Please. Yes! I even got lag frame. <laughs> okay, <laughs> that was awesome. Wow, even more hammer bros than normal 8-3. And they spawn weirdly. I want to defeat Final Ganon with beams. Oh, I wasn't ready for you. All right, we got the beams. Oh, they took out the Koopa. I wanted to show that Koopa, Koopa, wait! I said Final Ganon, I didn't know you were coming. Is this Bruce? What? What's the Bruce name for Ganon? Wait, oh, he's page wrapping? No, he's... I don't know what he's doing. <laughs> I actually really like randomly running into that guy in 8-3, like, really close to the end of the game. I think that's good. If the rest of the level was less vanilla, that'd be cool, too. <laughs> Phantom Ganon? Yeah, that's what it is. He even was floating. He's 100% Phantom Ganon. Lava pit in the pipe. In the pipe. This room one again? Oh. OK, 
okay, they changed which pipe is the proper pipe. That's good. Maybe you don't go in any pipe. Oh, wait. Oh. oh I'm scared, so I'm just gonna go in the pipe. <laughs> All of that was just to make me think it was gonna be vanilla, and then it wasn't. Very clever trick. That was an elaborate ruse. Okay, so this is like... This is what 8-4 looks like. Oh gosh, Prana Plants are so hard to hit, man. There's like two Y pixels I can hit them on. Yeah, so this is what 8-4 looks like when... <laughs> you're a gamer. Uh, when you don't use pipes to go between levels. Okay, so this is the final room. Normally Hammer Bro Potaboo, is there a Potaboo? Okay, final battle. Oh, there's a Hammer Bro. Bring it on. I want to be in his hammer arc because it feels lame to be out here. <laughs> but there's a Potaboo. Oh, okay. Just in time! It's not even over! Oh, it is. Okay. <laughs> okay, we're all done! We found the Triforce! I thought we were gonna get Zelda, but we found the Triforce! Quest is over. To select a world. Okay, right on! So that hack was pretty fun. I, um. Really cool theming choices, the sword beams, which sprites they picked for each thing, very cool. And most of the levels were decent. They changed like a lot of things. Occasionally I would see a screen and I'm like, this is just a normal screen from the game. But that became very common the farther we got. And it was like, dude, world six, this is just normal world six, come on. But overall it was really fun. <laughs> Why is the Triforce saying thank you to Link?